Oh, didn't see you there. Hello, my name is Max. I'm the Desert Oasis Lieutenant Governor. Hi everyone, I'm Samantha and I'm your District Service Chair. Hi, my name is Kim Mai and I am the District Convention Chair. And you're watching Sunny TV. Season 4. Episode 8. If you are new to Sunny TV, Sunny TV is the Circle K News segment that aims to bring you updates about the California, Nevada, Hawaii district. But we do have some other things, so right now we're going to give you some international updates. Hello, it is me, your favorite 2017-2018 California, Nevada, Hawaii district governor of Circle K International. I am here to do your international updates. First off, the international awards have been released. They are due early May, so make sure you do those soon to get those in on time. Next up is the international convention, which is going to be July 4th to the 8th. So make sure if you want to go or you're interested, you pay the $250 early bird fee by May 1st. And we'd love to see as many clubs there represented to represent the district and the candidates we have. So if you want to go, plan early and fundraise early so we can see you there. More information is in the description, so check it out. International. And now for some CNH district updates. So each year, CNH hosts what's called District Large Scale Service Project, otherwise known as DLSSP. And this event is really, really cool because we as a district are able to come together and make a huge impact on our communities because of how large our district is and how passionate our members are about service. This year, DLSSP North in Hawaii took place on February 17th. At DLSSP North, we were able to help three local elementary schools in the Oakland area by helping teachers renovate their classrooms, volunteering at one of the local school gardens, painting inspirational murals, and so much more. At DLSSP Hawaii, members participate in a wide variety of service projects all across the Hawaiian Islands. So some of those service projects included volunteering at a local food bank, at a local animal shelter, and then also volunteering at a local Ron McDonald house. DLSSP South took place on February 25th. We also worked with three different organizations at this project as well. So one of these organizations was called Veterans First OC, which essentially is an organization that helps provide housing and other services to homeless veterans in the OC area. We also volunteered at Thomas House Family Shelter, which is an organization that helps transitioning families by giving them housing and access to other resources that help them get off their feet. And our last site that we worked out was called La Quinta High School, and it's essentially just a local high school, and we were able to go over there and help them by renovating their athletic fields. So thank you to everyone who came to DLSSP this year. I hope you all had an amazing time, and for those of you who didn't come out this year, I hope to see you all at future events. Thank you! So in terms of other district updates, we do have the opportunity for Circle K members to be Sergeant at Arms or SAAs at both the upcoming Key Club and Key Winds District Conventions. So the Key Club Decon will be in Reno, Nevada from April 13th through April 15th and the Key Winds Decon will be in Woodland Hills, California from April 6th through April 8th. And at these events, you as a Circle K member will have the opportunity to attend their Decon, kind of check out what it's all about, but also, you, most importantly, you will be in charge of ensuring that they're safe, that everything is going according to plan, and yeah. And as the first district event of the new 2018-2019 term, we do have for you Spring Training Conference. So Spring Training Conference North will be held at Cal State East Bay from, on April 28th, and Spring Training Conference South will be held at Orange Coast College on May 5th. And at these events, you will be able to attend a bunch of workshops hosted by your fellow Circle K members, and you will get to interact with your entire north or south part of the district, which is really cool because you really get to meet everyone, everyone who's a new board member for the term, and you really get to network and interact with each other. So y'all should definitely check it out. The event pages are on Facebook. As for the next district event, District Convention 2018 En Route to Service is just around the corner. Be prepared for the road trip and also stay updated through our Facebook event page, our website, and any videos we release. Be excited for it and I'll see you all there. So as for some Desert Oasis updates, we have had a very busy three months, starting off with January WA. So the January weekend of Awesomeness Weekend happened from January 12th to January 14th, and the most notable event here was the 11th Annual Kids Rock Concert. 
So this is an event put on by Circle K at UC Riverside and it, in the end it raised over $5,000 for the pediatric trauma program which is really great. Um, so basically at K-Rock people who attended got to see a bunch of live performances, they got to play games, win some prizes, eat some delicious food, all for a really great cause and that was, that was really cool. Y'all should definitely check it out if you can in the future. And UNLV Circle K had their biggest fundraiser of the year, Serenade, on February 10th. So here members were able to go out to UNLV, and this was during our February WA. And here, um, kind of, the male singers would go up on stage, kind of sing an exhibition song, and then the audience would bid, yeah, I bid this amount of money, I bid this amount of money. And in the end, the highest bidders got to go up on stage and be serenaded by the performers. So it was really cool, it was really nice seeing like our members being able to go up there and show their talents. And then the female version came on March 10th. So here, this event is called March Melody, and it was very similar to Serenade, just at this time it was with female performers. And Serenade raised money for the Nevada Childhood Cancer Foundation, and March Melody is raising money for Relay for Life. And y'all should definitely check out these events and go to them if you are approved for them in 2019. Thank you for watching Sunny TV. Be sure to subscribe to this channel and like us on Facebook in order to receive notice on the next episode of Sunny TV, which is being brought to you by Golden Gate. Bye.